Hi guys, those of you who watch my good morning shorts where I do a quick run round of this stuff along with my breakfast will know that the pineapple powered cat stopped working today. So we're going to replace it. I could um, play around and see if we can get it to run a bit longer, but I'm not going to. Um, it might just be that that's broken. That's the magnesium strip. It gets eaten away by the chemicals inside the uh, pineapple in this case. And that's the copper strip. You can see the magnesium strip went right the way through. All right, copper strip. Oh dear, that's. There we go. All right, copper strip. What I'm going to do is clean both them up, and then we have a white cabbage. Why a white cabbage? Because just been in Tesco's, and they've got them reduced in their sort of clearance section. Normally, I think eighty-five pence or something. Reduced to fifteen pence. So, I'm going to cut a couple of slots in it. Uh, clean those up. Just a little bit of sandpaper to get the surface. Uh, Oxidation of it, probably oxidation could be some other chemical other than oxygen, but it'll help for it to be clean. Good idea to wash your hands after you've been doing something like this. All right, let's stick that one in there. And then this one, which is a bit short, but it'll be enough for us to work out whether it's actually going to work or not. Ignore the fact that he's rocking a little bit at the moment. That's because I've just knocked him. Oh. Okay. Pop that in there. Ah, we have a problem. We can't reach it. Uh, I need to lift that up so it can reach across. I'll find something to put underneath. Clock out on me. Okay, negative on there, positive on there. That would appear we've got a voltage or current flow. I'll get the meter just to see what we've got. Can you see that? Nope, because I'm in the way. Hope you can see that. Just over a volt. If I disconnect that so there's no load on it. One point three. Is my arm in the way? No, I think we can just see. So according to that, we've got about one point three no load, just over one volt with the load on there. Right. Uh, today 
happens to be April the 1st, but this is not an April Fool's joke. This is, see if it works and how long it lasts for. People do ask whether these things smell like the potatoes and the carrot that I've got over there. And at the moment, no, they don't smell. I think the point is they're drying out rather than going rotten. So when they're drying out, they're not smelling as badly as they would do if they were just going rotten in a cupboard somewhere. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave us a comment so I know I'm doing. And somewhere up here there'll be some links to related playlists. Thanks again.